see who does it better. Scaling right. time. Right, it's scaling with the Ziggs. Will they be able to get something going with the Kha'Zix? Let's find out. Game number two, T1's backs along the wall. Will they win? Let's find out. Bam, Degon. We Bam. Are, we are finding out in this next game because Team Flash. Mark, let me up? tell you something about myself. Okay, okay. I'd love to find out. Find out what? Anything, man. <laughs> <laughs> Where are we going with this? <laughs> Nowhere. <laughs> Very obviously. <laughs> that bit, that bit crashed. <laughs> Absolutely nowhere, but <laughs> I was kind of hoping it would be like funny. Oh. But... <laughs> I feel like you just invited me onto a train. Sure. And I was like, okay, well, where are we going on this train? And you said, I don't know. <laughs> Pick one. I'm like, I, I don't want to pick. Critically, not how trades work, so the analogy is perfect. <laughs> Welcome to game number two. As Degon set, T1 are up against the wall. Will they win? We'll find out. Team Flash, one win away from advancing to the group stage. And you were talking to me as the draft phase was going what? on. What? I was? Yeah. Oh. T TJ, we can, we can acknowledge that casters oh, okay. do talk to each other before the game starts. I thought it was like the teacher's out of school thing. And we're just like when you see your cat talking to... in the supermarket and you're like, oh, what's this? Wait, you're out of your coffin? <laughs> Drake, um, so the better objective here is the infernal Drake. And you can see T1 settling for the Rift Herald. They're doing that because they know they lose the team fight right now. They yeah. know that the Ash Arrow, the layer at CC is really devastating during the early game. So they're instead focusing on this. It is three to one currently on empty. the top side of the month. But it's a Crystal Enchanted Arrow from Coyote. Empty can almost capitalize the final spark. They tried to knock him into the final spark. Oh, he tried man. to headbutt him into the final spark. That might be the <laughs> sickest thing I've ever seen, Mark, and it didn't even work. That's a good Team Flash. This is the Team Flash that fell apart versus Nova Esports that we're seeing here. Okay, this time Ellie knows that he has no flash. Just what one more auto attack. First blood from Team Flash, and now the rest of the reinforcements are coming in hot. San United gives Ellie the extra shield and tells JY back off. That's the wombo combo, but uh, first time we've seen it pretty late in the game. Oh, Shy flashing forward with the taunt. Doesn't connect it on the JY, but it's enough pressure to control and guarantee the mid lane tower. Traded though, opposite side of the map, Core will grab a turret. As the hold. bottom lane is around the corner. T1 need a fight here, but they can win it. VDG's damage will be online. What? What? MT? How did he steal the dragon? I think it was an auto attack. No way. And now T1, this fight is all erupted into chaos. Jong trying to save it, but MT on the support line. Duty coming in after stealing the dragon, stopping Jong in his tracks. Absolute disaster for T1. That was either an auto attack or the AoE pulse from his third ability. And it was comboed with the arrow, because the arrow does AoE damage, so Coyote hit somebody else, stunned out their damage on the dragon, did an extra bit of burst, and MT got the final tick. An absolute disaster for T1, is for sure. Team Flash fully pressing forward, and it seems that T1 have just lost all control. And Zisu Ooh. goes Ooh, a little too far for forward. And it will cost them dearly, not only, of course, the second dragon in the game, but also a team fight, the one they needed. They'll force this here instead. Well, T1 are now forced to pump the gas. They need to get back in this game. Jong is leading the charge already. Answer back by Zisu. And now damage is coming back through BDG. from Ellie, flashing forward. But it is JY with the resets. And the rest of T1 supporting their jungler, even in the aftermath of the dragon. They are right back in this game. Shy tried to use the Sand United to get into the fight. His target got burned down by an explosive cask, so he's trapped on the outside of the fight. A 4v5 taken by Team Flash. Nay, a 3v5 as the first player dies. And a positive one for T1 now is the Baron spawn. Whoa, and T1 say, let's, let's do it. Right now, we're burning it down as fast as possible. Shy. They're doing a great job of Coyote. it. 7,000, 6,000, but teleports are coming in. Shy is buying as much time as he can. Oh, man, Coyote Z2. takes out JY. It has gone from the pretty good to really bad for T1. Team Flash capitalized. They Whole recognize that T1 were looking for everything, but Team Flash said, no, you can't have everything. You got to slow down. We're the ones in control. And a, ve a very aggressive play by Team Flash. Flash the entire team. All fronts the Baron and Power Dominions. 
chunking the turrets super easily. Already mid inhibitor's gone. Shy, Sisu, and Ellie pushing through the bottom side of the map. Explosive cast sends Good them cast. all astray. Empty once again with a powerful knockup. And Team Flash. There it is. This time around, all three inhibitors have been taken in one barren push. And do they have enough strength to close up the game right here, right now? Yeah, they do, Mark. Team Flash finish game number two. Team Flash doing everything right by the book this time around. Team Flash showing why they are the number one seed for the WCS, and they will advance to the 